Why do you always put a cushion there? Well, I learned this from Bianca Del Rio because I don't want to... I already had one wardrobe malfunction. You did. So I, I've learned to put a cushion in my crutch when wearing a skirt. I might do that too. Okay. Let's do... Let's be... Cozy. It is, you can Skull do top. that. I like that a lot. I'm going to do that all the time. <laughs> so, well done. Thank you. Well done. I think the nation just thought, yay. It was remarkable when you were in there, though, because you were so articulate and you explained quite complex... You know, because people get terribly, terribly caught, you know, in, in knots about mm. things about gender and sexuality and all of that. And you explained it so beautifully. Thank you. And it was great. It's one of those things where I remember when um, the whole sort of trans and gender sort of conversation started with Caitlyn Jenner and Laverne Cox and, and such. And I remember I was confused and didn't know what the words were. And I heard people saying, you can say and can't say this. And I, I thought how do I learn more? And I just went on the internet, read things. I mean, mm. obviously, this has been my life for a very long time, but sure. even I was confused by the letters and the things and just, you know, reading books and talking to friends and working with people, I was like, oh, I understand this now. And now hopefully I can explain it um, to people in a way that they can understand. No, exactly. It's not I'm... just boy or girl or gay or straight or black or white. It is all the things in between. And yeah. I, think we're, I think we're smart enough now and we get the conversations enough now that we can, we can start to break it down from just sure. the two options and say, oh, well, this is the difference between a trans woman and a drag queen and a gay person and a straight person and a black person and a brown person and a white person. <laughs> it's like, you know. But we're all just trying to go on with our lives, aren't, aren't we? We're we really to get our Starbucks order right. <laughs> exactly, of course. Now, someone like Anne, yes. you're never going to change her point of view no. ever. And it was really interesting because we had Amanda Barry on last uh -huh. last week, and Amanda, of course, is is gay now. Came out very yes. late, got married very late in life to her, to her wife, and she's fine. You know, she's having a great life, and she's a lovely, lovely girl. But she just basically didn't ever go there with Anne. Mm. She just didn't go to any of these things because she said it would just. She's never going to change her mind yeah. and that's the trouble. Do you think in any way you changed Anne? I really don't know. I mean, I did talk to her about it and she said, do you think this is the first time I've ever met a gay person or met a drag queen or anything like that? She's like, I've, I, I live in this world and I work in entertainment. Like I know lots of diverse people. Yeah. Um, and I, what I really kept in my mind is I'm not going to change Anne's opinions, but maybe people watching, whether it be in the house or people at home, will hear two sides of an argument. That was the thing. Yeah. That was exactly it. Yeah. What now? What's going to happen now? I mean, if you want to do your own version of Drag Race, I'll be Michelle Visage to you. All right. Easily. But I mean, I I'd like love that. to see you. You're clearly a natural. You're a brilliant communicator. Thank you. And, you know, I just wonder what is next for you what you'd like to do? Well, at the moment, I'm kind of I'm it's crazy. just taking yeah, it all in. I'm just shaking the tree and see what falls to the ground, really. Um, and just looking at opportunities. I'm a live performer as well. I love being on stage. I'm doing a tour in like the a UK great voice. in June. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. And, um, and just, yeah, seeing... I'd love to do television. I love talking. I love conversations. And I love pretty colours and costumes, too. So maybe Excellent. something that can incorporate all that. Well, you know, when I'm off on holiday, yeah. you could come and step in. Hey, I mind. won't say no to that, Lorraine. <laughs> I think it'd be great. I think it'd be absolutely amazing.